I'm Zach, I work at Sierra uh, at Tahoe, I'm a security guard and I happened to see a marmot fly out of a hawk's talons, I believe it was a hawk or an offspray. I'm not real good on the birds, but in F lot, I was kind of nervous because I didn't, I thought it was a squirrel or a marmot, but his eye was shut and he was still alive and I rushed him down to the wildlife care center and he survived. I brought in this little marmot, he thought it might be a squirrel, we, we weren't really sure, it was in a huge box about this big. I looked at it and it was in really bad shape, really dehydrated. Um, and its eye had, it was crusted over and it appeared that its eye had been punctured. And so at first glance I thought, oh man, I don't know if this marmot's going to make it. The first thing I did when he left was call the vet and the vet was able to come over that afternoon and look at it and clean the eye up and the eye's there and intact and functioning perfectly. And so um, that afternoon I just gave him some fluids sub-Q fluids and kept him hydrated and we fixed some formula for him and got him drinking um, through a syringe and he was doing great the next day and then Cheryl got home and <laughs> he's, he's great. My name is Cheryl Milheim. I am one of the founders and the executive director of Lake Tahoe Wildlife Care and we're so pleased that, that they got it here as fast as they did because I don't think she would have lived if they hadn't have. She was in pretty bad shape. But, uh, I hope all your people know that we're here to help you and when you find any animal don't try to take care of it yourself. Get it down so we can either have the vet look at it or get it on the right diet and, and get it cared for properly. But I'm so happy to get her back home where she belongs with her family.